beautifuls, it's me, Alyssa. So today I have my December Ipsy bag for 2014. This will be my last Ipsy bag for the year until January. Um, so I am going to still stay subscribed even though um, I don't... I've gotten some really good bags. I, I know a lot of people have their mixed opinions on Ipsy and don't like it that much. But I've been really liking the bags um you know i get some good months i get some not so good months but i think overall it's kind of worth it for the ten dollars that you are spending for it um i like them i use the bags all the time i'm always switching them out for you know month to month and i use them for all different things i store you know my makeup in them i take them on the go with me so i really do find the bags useful um, because I'm always switching them out and I can use them for things and so they've been useful to me and I have been I have used some of the makeup some of the makeup I did give away as gifts and so you know it has been really useful for me you know when when getting the ipsy products because I don't use everything but I am able to you know give whatever I'm not using you know as a gift and someone will get more use out of it than I will so I do really like ipsy so if you guys are not that interested in Ipsy videos, you don't have to watch, but I really do like Ipsy, and I really do think it's worth it, um, but I'm really excited for the December Ipsy bag, because I really like it, um, it's so fun, and the bag is so awesome, like, it's, I really like this, I really am going to use it for my makeup storage, for, I always have, like, a bag out that I have my current makeup in, so I'm really excited for this one. And sorry that it's dark. It keeps getting dark lately. There has been no sun that much, and it's been dreadful. But I'm really excited about this bag because this bag is so super, um, it's, it's long. And it has a keychain on it, which is very different for Ipsy. It has a little Ipsy logo keychain. And the theme for this month is Thinking of You. And this is what their card looks like. So each card has a different, um saying on it but mine says fearless heroine but every card has for each ipsy user has something different on it so other people might have gotten something else on the front of their card but mine just says um fearless heroine but the theme is thinking of you because i looked it up on their website and i'm really excited for this bag because it has some really cool products in it this um this month that i got and i really like the black it's, it's bag it's very sleek and you know very easy to maintain and it's pink and black two of my favorite combination colors so i really like that and i also liked november's bag it was silver glitter and pink which was also another one of my favorite combinations so it was very a good go and it's actually one of my current makeup bags that i'm using so i'm really excited to jump into the december ipsy bag for 2014 this is my last one for 2014 till 2015 and i'm so super excited so I'm going to get started. So first off is the Beauty Without Cruelty Facial Cleanser. So this is a cleanser that is made cruelty free, not tested on any animals, and it's really nice. It has, um, it benefits normal to oily skin, and I'm really excited for this because I smell this, and this smells cool, very nicely. And there goes the cap. <laughs> but it smells so good. I don't know, it smells me... I don't know, it's, it's, it smells good. It's like a familiar smell to me. I can't really describe what the smell sounds like, but it smells really good. It's like a very clear gel-like consistency. And so I've been looking for new skincare products to try out. I'll go put the cap, cap up later after this video. But I've been really wanting to try, you know, new facial skincare products because I'm always on the hunt for new new skincare. And I've been having just like some breakage, breakout itch lately. I don't know if you could see, but I tried concealing it up. But, I'm always on the hunt for new skincare. I love trying skincare products. It's like one of my favorite things to try out. <laughs> so I'm really excited to try that out because I'm always on the look for great skincare products that will make my skin feel nice and smooth. Especially it's winter, so it's going to be nice to keep the skin clear and just very nice and soft. So I'm really excited for that. The next thing, the next two things I'm really excited about because I've I, I just think these are amazing. So the first thing is the Caitlin Just a Mineral Eye Polish in number 5 Orchid. It's not Orchid color. I don't know why it's called Orchid, but it's not Orchid. But it comes in this, like, cute little 
thing. It kind of reminds you like a nail polish bottle, but it is this sponge tip applicator that you just dip it into the container and it has the eyeshadow on it so there's no brush required and the color is absolutely gorgeous it's like a champagne nude color it's a very nice color i think it's very it's super 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 pretty very pigmented and the great thing is you don't need a brush because you can just use the sponge and it's just i just think it's super nice you know, I always like looking for nice shimmery, kind of champagne-y eyeshadows because I'm really like into that whole kind of champagne eyeshadow look because it's very easy to put on. If you're not going to mess up champagne eye eyeshadow. So it's really nice to wear. So I really do love this product a lot. And then the next thing I got was a NYX product. If you don't know me, I am obsessed with NYX. If you look at my video before this, I did a Ulta haul and it was just NYX makeup because I'm just crazy obsessed with it. And... I haven't tried these yet. I haven't really, you know, gotten to, you know, tr trying these or, you know, having, like, any, you know, feel to try them yet. But, um, I really like this. It smells really good. Um, this is their NYX Butter Lip Balms. I, if you know me, I love the butter lipsticks. I'm not wearing one today, but I wish I was. But I love the butter lipsticks. And I really wasn't, you know, thinking about if I wanted to try the butter lip balms yet. But... I got this one in marshmallow, so I'm really eager to try it. I don't know what it smells like. But it smells pretty good. I don't know. It's it's doesn't really show up on the skin because I tried doing a swatch of it. But I think it's just gonna be like one of those like kind of just tinted lip balms. It's just one of those tinted ones, so it doesn't show up that much. But I don't know. I was like a very you can see like a very faint, slight wash, but it might show up better on the lips. But it's in the color Marshmallow. It's like this kind of nudish kind of natural color, which is really nice. And it's going to keep my lips moisturized. So I'm always on the hunt for, you know, looking for nice lip balms that are moisturizing and just very soft. And plus it gives like a hint of a hint of color, so it's really nice. And I love NYX products, so NYX hasn't really disappointed me. So I think it's going to be definitely well worth it to try, so I can't wait to try that out and let you guys know what I how I feel about it okay last two things um I got a mascara this is the Tarte Lights Camera Lashes this is all mini says I'm not gonna open it yet because I have other mascaras I have to use but um I've been looking into reviews about this one so I hoping it gives really nice volumized lashes because that's something I really am looking for something that's giving just very volumized lashes. So, Tarte's Lights Camera Lashes. But I've had, I've heard, I think I've heard some good things about it. Um, but I'm always eager to try new mascaras, especially if they're going to make my, my eyelashes look good. Okay, last thing I got was the Big Sexy Hair. Um, I love the I love the Sexy Hair line. It's really, really great hair products. Um, so this is the Style Sexy Hair. 450 blowout seven shine one hold um so you basically use this on damp hair and then you just spray it on your hair i don't have i don't have wet hair but i'm gonna i'm gonna try this out and see how it works but it just has a spray spray nozzle and then you just use it on damp hair and you could just brush it out and you could blow dry it so i am really excited to use this because i i really haven't had one of those like shine sprays i haven't really invested in any of those but I'm really excited to try these because I do love the sexy hair line. I love their um, hairsprays. I use their hairsprays. Um, so they are really great. Um, they really do have really great products. So I really would recommend trying them. And I'm always eager to try new things from their line. So I'm really excited to try this out once my hair is wet. But that is everything I've gotten in my Ipsy bag. It was a really good end to end. end uh, it was a very good way to end the month. Um... I'm scattered brain lately, so I don't even know what I'm saying lately. Um, but that is everything I got in my December bag. I am very excited to try everything. So I hope you guys enjoyed. And there are many more videos still to come for 2014, so just stay tuned. But this is my last Ipsy bag for 2014. I hope you guys enjoyed. And let me know if you want other subscription services um, besides Ipsy, because I know everybody doesn't like it. So 
if you have a recommendation of a subscription service you would like me to try, leave me, leave me a comment in the comments section down below and I will get back to you. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have a beautiful and magical day. I love you all and stay tuned for my next video. Love you beautifuls.